Hey guys, good morning, afternoon, night, whenever it is that this video is supposed to find you. For me, it is night time. Um, that way is way too fucking creepy. So, my new nighttime routine is kind of different now, especially now that we moved. Um, I didn't vlog today because a lot of stuff happened to the point where I didn't want to vlog. So... Yeah, I just know that everything's okay now. It was just a rough patch that we were going through, Caleb and I, and we're okay now. Um, I've been working on the room. Um, I also switched clothes. I know you guys can't see this, but I'm wearing my school um, shorts and a tank top. Um, so, yeah. Me at Pizza Hut waiting for my hubby. I really wish I could stop fucking things up, guys. It's been a fucking roller coaster. No matter what I do, I say and do the wrong things. And I wish I could stop doing that because he's a really good guy. And we have three beautiful girls. And I really don't want to do anything to fuck that up. Beverly to help us with some extra things that we tied to our accessory thing, and Beverly is planning on it. I've never seen a war between the conscious and subconscious So, yeah. Uh, I'm coming along with this crazy journey on Cole Ice. And yeah, yeah, this is our room. I'll do a full on room tour as soon as it's done. We have to clean it still and just finish hanging some stuff up. I just got out of the shower because it's fucking cold and I needed to um, get my body temp back up, so. Yeah, laundry is going. Ow! Scam's being an ass. Yeah, he's still going. Don't know how much longer. He's hardly doing much, so. I'll give you guys updated on him. Shout out to you, Beverly. Thank you for the help. And then all Caleb owes for rent next payday is like 40 bucks. So. So, I brushed my hair. The room is looking so much better. All I have to do is, all I have is like a shit ton of trash and um, stuff that needs to be put away. But I just cleaned up the cat's little mess over there so that way Caleb can change the litter box. And then we can just like scrub the shit out of the carpet from the cat's accident. And then I'll probably put the pad down once we get that figured out. But uh, I also just restocked the uh, pull-ups section, um, put some in the bathroom, some in the living room, um, and I'm going to put the rest, I don't know where, probably, in the living room, that's probably where, or in the bathroom, I don't know. Um, almost done with the Vampire Diaries, this is what looks like an awesome, so like, yeah, the only thing on this wall right now is, yeah, litter boxes down there, but. It's just a TV. And then, like I said, the door was a box of trash. Um, like I said, I'll do a full, like, room tour and everything once we get this room, like, a little bit, like, more homey. Um, so, yeah. Hey, guys. Um, this little portion of the video is just, this, is just to cover a new story that um, happened here in my town. So, in my town, a lot of bad things happen here. At least you would think, right? Aurora is a retirement home, a lot more old folk than younger folk. Um, but we've had two murders here recently. Um, I'm just going to cover them all because I used to go to school with Acorn and I knew of him and stuff like that. So I was in the 18 was driven and killed DUI, her passenger, Acorn is his nickname. You'll see in the news story that I screen recorded in the next clip that he passed away. So I just want to say RIP him and I give my condolences to all his friends and family. 
that. I'm just going to just cover this one specifically because this one really hurt when I found out that he passed away. So. Hey guys, to end off this video, I'm going to just say goodbye. We are currently gaming. I'm totally excited. I'm playing Call of Duty with this brother. And everyone is in bed. So yeah, I'm just chilling. I recorded a few cover songs for that playlist. And yeah. I'll catch you guys probably tomorrow.